My name is Jonathan Wallace, and um, I'm in my last year in criminal justice and public policy. I'm from Malton, Ontario. Uh, I chose CJPP at GO for quite a few reasons. One was um, I like the criminal justice program that we had here. When I came on a visit here, it was um, very friendly, uh, very tight-knit community. So that's something that I wanted to be a part of. I guess I knew what I wanted to do, but I have a lot of friends who were um, very undecided with what they wanted to do. So having like the first year to just take uh, a lot of different classes and a lot of electives kind of helps people shape their university career, like what they end up wanting to take in the, the next or the upcoming years. A couple of things that I enjoy about the, the program is just learning a lot about society and why things happen. Um, kind of making sense of some of the craziness that goes on in our society. I've learned a lot about uh, since being here. As well, uh, I've had a prof, Ian Spears, that has just really like been a great impact on my life and just his influence has been good for me as well being here. Yeah, um, I'm actually a part of the Student Athlete Mentorship Program with um, helping athletes who come in, try to help them get um, acclimated with some of the stuff that are going on on campus, get them connected with stuff like writing services, um, even counseling services, health services, all that type of stuff so they know where things are on campus, know how to access stuff in the library. Um, and then we work with some older athletes as well who have struggled in school for whatever reason or maybe have tough classes um, to try to help them bounce back. So it's like a very specific program for athletes. Well, my first plan um, is to get into law school. So I've applied to law school and um, I'm working on writing my LSAT again. Um, a little bit after that, I would really like to work with athletes and be kind of like a sports agent where I deal with athletes contracts and stuff like that. So that's kind of the long term goals that I have. So for, for both, I guess I would say for future athletes first, I guess coming in is just try to be as focused as you can um, and not let like the stress of having to balance school, basketball and a social life um, get to you, I guess, and try to get help earlier. Uh, try and figure out what you want to do because this is like kind of the time of our lives where we can make mistakes and not really pay that much for them. So I would say make mistakes and see what you can do. I think it builds a lot of character and you help kind of grow uh, through some of those mistakes and through some of those learning experiences. So just exploring as many different possibilities and options as you can.